welcome back to the channel so this is my iphone 6s that i have here it's currently running ios 14 and one of the main features that we saw introduced with ios 14 is basically picture in picture so if i'm to open my safari that you see here and go to youtube which i am right and play in a specific video this is the video that i'm playing and then if i enter the full screen version of that video by just clicking there and then basically minimizing this video or this safari by clicking the home button just like that you can see that the video continues to play picture in picture and i can sort of browse around whilst the video is playing and i also have the option to sort of make it bigger or make it smaller and i can push it up or push it down and the letdown or the disadvantage of this that i don't like is that this feature is apparently not available on the youtube app so on the native youtube app this is not available and let's just close this picture in picture by just closing the x there now if we open the youtube app right and play any specific video on youtube and then enter full screen right so let's enter full screen you can see that first of all it tilts and then if we minimize the video right just like we did when we we're playing the video from safari by doing this you can see that it does not support this picture in picture now this is something that youtube needs to enable or embed in the youtube app so as far as today is concerned this feature isn't yet available for ios 14 on the native youtube app now i want to show you something that you can basically enable this in the native youtube app and shout out to falig mandag 89 on reddit for providing this shortcut that we are going to be using to make it possible so basically you see this application here this is the shortcut application now by default if you are on ios 13.6 or on ios 14 you basically have this uh, shortcut app right it's a uh, apple application and so you basically have this app and what you want to do basically is to use this link that i will provide in the description of this video and download the picture in picture shortcut that was provided so if you click this link that i'll leave in the description of this video you can see that it's a youtube picture in picture shortcut and then what you want to do is to click get shortcut right there so as you can see it loads and for me it says it's, it can't be opened because it's from an untrusted or third party source and so by default the shortcut app settings disables shortcuts from unknown sources so to overcome this just click ok and then go to settings right so go to your device settings and then scroll down to where it says shortcut which should be on the s section and there's shortcut and then you want to allow this uh, option that says allow untrusted shortcuts so sure. you can see that for me i have the option and i can turn it on and yeah it will ask you again are you sure you want to allow this and then just click allow so now the shortcut should be able to work if you do come into settings and you don't see this option just go back to your shortcut app right and then go to where it says uh, gallery here and basically add any of the shortcuts that you see here there's quite a number of shortcuts as you can see and just add like the youtube shortcut and yeah just say add to siri and you can see the shortcut has been added and then come back to your settings app and if you at first couldn't see this allow untrusted shortcuts option then you should be able to see that so yeah that's how you overcome that and yeah as you can see we've allowed untrusted shortcuts and the next thing that we want to do again is to now use the link that i'll leave so that you can get the youtube picture and picture shortcut and just click on it again and click get shortcut and as you can see this time around it accepted and scroll all the way down right if you want to read what it does or the description and spec of it this is um what you can go through but if you scroll all the way down you see that you can add untrusted shortcut or don't add shortcut and the option we want is add untrusted shortcut so add the shortcut and so the shortcut has been added right if you want to see it you basically go to my shortcut section there and that's where you will see the shortcut and as you can see here it's youtube picture in picture since it's the latest shortcut that we added to our shortcut app this is the shortcut app so you can see that it shows up on top right so we've added a shortcut and the next thing that we want to do basically we're not yet done we're almost there is to open the app store right so open the app store and then search for scriptable so let's just search for scriptable and then download the app 
so yeah as you can see this is the application that i've just downloaded it's scriptable and it's automation using javascript so that's the application that you want to download next and just open it and basically you don't have to do anything in this application once it's downloaded you can close it now the next thing that you want to do now since you've added the shortcut and downloaded the scriptable app that you see here right you want to now go into your youtube app so your native youtube app open that and then basically um, play in a specific video right so i'm playing this video here that you see and then go to where it says share so if you click on share and then you see here where it says more option right you can click that and then if you scroll down you have this option here for youtube picture in picture so if you click that you can see that this pop-up will show up where it says YouTube picture in picture would like to access scriptable. This shortcut will be able to access the data from and send data to the scriptable app. So just click OK when this pop-up shows up and basically you will see this loading. And then once it's done loading, you basically see all these options and your video will continue to play picture in picture right so as you can see here we have quite a number of options that we actually didn't have with the initial safari picture in picture this is playback speeds that you can change if you want to make the video slower or make the video faster right so you can do that as the video plays picture in picture and then you have also the resolution you can say select 720p or 330p and you can see that you can download this video here right and also you can see that you can resize the video and yeah you can minimize and the video will continue to play picture in picture you can do whatever you want you can even edit notes or continue to uh, read messages or just you know whatever you were doing right so that's how you do it so as you can see here it's quite a process right having to go in and press share and then select picture in picture it, it takes some time so if you want to make the process shorter right so that you can be able to play picture in picture video using the native youtube app faster just open the youtube app and then click share right and then go to where it says more right there and then scroll all the way down where you see edit actions so just click edit and then scroll down to see where it says youtube picture in picture right so just click that you know the little plus sign that's there and as you can see it has added picture in picture to our favorites right and then click done right Right? so play a video and then if you click share and then click more option instead of having to scroll all the way down to look for picture in picture you can see that it's right there on our favorites it's just the second option after copy and that means that you can basically access it faster so that's how you do it and that's how you access picture in picture faster using the native youtube app and as you can see it's very good you have quite a number of options and it's working so if you'd like to see some of my other shortcuts that i use and if you have any specific shortcut that you want me to provide right let me know in the comment section below and i'll be able to provide some of these shortcuts and once again shout out to falig magdag 89 for providing this shortcut and yeah basically that's how you do it picture in picture using the native youtube app i really hope that youtube in future will provide this option in the default youtube app as you know an option where you don't have to add the shortcut but for now seems like this is the workaround and if you like this video and you find it helpful in a way please leave a like and hit subscribe down below and thank you very much for watching guys stay safe and i will definitely see you in the next video peace